what's good y'all it's your boy ross back at again with another video so we're gonna check out wwe top 20 lights out returns in history man you know when the lights go out in the arena somebody makes their surprise return or somebody pops out of nowhere that's it's always a, a hokey moment in wrestling but it's always an entertaining moment for the most part the lights just mysteriously go out and a wrestler standing right behind you how did he get there who knows but we're gonna check it out appreciate all the love and support on the channel y'all man road to 70k and uh let's get right into this bad boy you dig it, sucker! Oh, right here. Right here. <laughs> and Xavier Woods have come out here to help Kofi Kingston. But Roman Reigns is there. This young man from Kusango, Kofi. Oh, oh, oh. Kofi Kingston to put his money in the bank. Yep. You gotta love it. What the? Oh my God, it's Wyatt. What? It's Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt on the going after Roman Reigns. Yep. Sister Abigail. You deserve so much better, Bray. You always deserve so much better. Night, Charlotte Flair. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he had been talking trash to The Undertaker for a little minute, and then to see this moment finally happen, even though it was a glorified squash match, was cool to see. Just to see that, that was. It was just cool to see CD Undertaker. Just, it's always cool to see him at the WrestleMania. I can't be to get my belt back because I'd be. Uh oh. Uh oh. I, I'm sorry. I don't. The dark I don't. Soak and lock the destruction. What is it? Man, look at this quality. I can't. Wow. It's the warrior. <laughs> Feel the real power, Hogan. <laughs> Look at Hulk Hogan selling it. No. <laughs> this was such a dope entrance, bro. Oh, my God. This is a dope <laughs> entrance. And then... Oh man. The cross face sleeper. Rollins tapped. That to me was one of the best matches at SummerSlam. Oh, it was so good. Him coming out to the brood entrance, the lights go out, and then on this day, I see clearly. <laughs> Oh my gosh, man. It's definitely one of the matches. I, I you, you got to go see it. If you haven't seen it, go watch this match. This was really, really good. It's, it's not too many times that, you know, I can sit up here and give WWE a lot of praise. But I give them a lot of praise for this match to set up in that entire feud between him and Seth Rollins. Fantastic. Extreme hours of wrestling. Uh oh. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> You're not running this interview. I am, cause I'm Brian Pillman. Oh man. Fantastic. This is great. Once again, you deserve so much better. And I hope you do get better, man. I hope wherever you go with it, AEW, whoever company, I hope they treat you better and take better care of the characters that you've created. Because what you've given us in WWE, we may not ever receive from, you know, we may not ever get again. He's created, he's reinvented himself multiple times and both times was fantastic. Of course, The Undertaker's gonna be all in this clip. He's all about popping out of the darkness. Oh, 
<laughs> Love it. It should be obvious to each and every one of you people, Eric Bischoff is back in a damn big way. You think you know me. That's a young age right there, man. <laughs> he speared the shit out of it. <laughs> Let's go back, bro. May you rest in peace, my guy. Picking up recognition, that would lead me to my next topic. Rest in peace. If you say that word one more time, I'm going to take action. <laughs> All you wise asses over here, <laughs> cut your lights out. You Wait. Wow, that's, I've never seen this segment before. This is actually the first time we've seen this. He said, cut the lights out. You say that shit one more time. This big man, he shut the mouth. Cut them all out. No. That's you cool. <laughs> I've never seen this segment. Yo, this second was just standing right behind him. Wait a minute. Where was what? I've never seen this segment. I don't remember this segment at all. This is actually I'm not making this up. Holy shit, we gotta go back to this. Wait. What? 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 Ah <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> this is so funny, bro. Vegas <laughs> was like, who the fuck is you know this guy? I don't know this guy. <laughs> oh my god, it's so <laughs> fucking John Cena! <laughs> Not the shaking camera effect. Oh my! The Ayatollah of Rock and Roll! Uh, I believe uh, there is a recent report where saying uh, Jericho, I believe he was uh, doing a concert with uh, Fozzie overseas and uh, he had to um, be sent to, uh, to the emergency room. Well, not emergency room, to a hospital. So I'm not sure. How, you know, how he's doing, but prayers go out to him. Uh, hopefully, uh, you know, he's recovering. Not sure what happened exactly. So if you guys know, comment down below, let me know. But I did see people were talking about it in my sub box about uh, um, Jericho being hospitalized. So wishing him a speedy recovery, man. He's definitely a legend in wrestling. And we always got to show our flowers, sh you know, show them flowers while they're still here. That's That's always the goal to show that. We appreciate everything they've done for us. Whether it's in WWE, AEW, Ring of Honor, it doesn't matter. New Japan Pro, we appreciate them for always entertaining us no matter wherever they went. So, lifeless body, Ballister. Oh my God! He's here. <laughs> Styles! Oh, you gotta love it every time. The authority, oh, yeah. it's authority power so, reign. And then Sting coming out, still one of the the most iconic things to see. Sting in the WWE ring, only for him to lose at WrestleMania to Triple H. Just still irritates me. Oh, Sting! It's Sting! The vigilante! I like how Randy Orton was like, all right. Undertaker, man. 
<laughs> he will always, I, honestly, it could be a compilation of just all the times the lights went out and it was The Undertaker, you know what I'm saying? It's just, I really wish I could have seen him in person, like wrestle. Just that entrance alone. Uh oh. Who was that? I'm trying to see who that is. Oh! Wow. Hey, ECW was a different time. It was as devastating a TLC match as standing dominant. Damn, man. Ah, I wish you the best, Jeff. Hope you hope you're okay, man. And uh, just take care of yourself, man. That's all that matters. I think this is when. Yup. It's the gong. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. You hear the pop from the crowd. And the millions. And millions. Nine other men that'll be gunning for the same thing. Bro, he was dripping with sweat. Oh, Ladies and gentlemen. He was dripping with sweat. He was oh busted God, open. He here? The beast is here. To be a man and come down here, boy. <laughs> or are you going to sit here? This was a cool moment. And then this made that segment even more better, bro. Oh, uh, that was pretty cool to see all three of them in the same ring. Yup, Kane. This is Kane. This this is a cool moment. That I can see why that being a being number one. I can see that potentially. I can see that. Would I have made it my number one for this type of video? I'm not sure if I would have made it my number one. I think for me personally, the number one clip <laughs> for me got to be the, the Stone Cold. I didn't. I I may have probably forgotten about this clip. That clip. I don't remember seeing that live. So. The Stone Cold one for me would probably get number one in this video. Just the simple fact that he cut off the lights in each section because they kept saying the what chance only for them to turn back the lights on and he's right there. Just what? What? Oh, that's so fucking funny, bro. Comment down below. Let me know what was your favorite clip from this video. Uh, appreciate all the love and support. Road 2. 70k appreciate y'all kicking with me see y'all on the next one peace